What is up? This is SM127. I'm gonna be reacting to Evil Nanny Kidnaps Kid for Ransom. Shocking. And yes, I am aware of the controversy that Darman is, is under. Such as like underpaying his workers, and that's terrible. Like how like how do you not pay your workers enough? Anyway, three, two, one, clickety clack and go. No writing on the wall. Jesse, you're hurting me. Stop your whining. You have coloring books for this. Why would you make a mess? Let go, let go. That's a <laughs> bad girl. You are getting a spanking. Oh no, that's abusive. That's not what happened. What happened was that you were trying to beat her. You child beater. And look at her. Good night, Miss Hopkins. So the evil nanny that's gonna kidnap this kid for ransom. Are you okay? Shocking. You seem upset early. That's because she was. But you can always talk to me, okay? Yes. Jesse, to keep this window shut. It's not safe. Yeah, it's not safe at all. Are you installing a nanny cam? Yeah. No, more. We've known Jesse since Celia was in Pampers. She's like family. We can't make her feel uncomfortable by installing a cam. She's going to feel like we don't trust her. Well, do we? I have to say this, but people aren't always the way they seem. Yeah, she people aren't always the way they seem. And this is and that quote sure is really ironic, safe. especially considering what's going on right Julia. now Jesse with like, like within the Darman family. No, with how Darman pays his actors like very Jesse. little. I'm not about to keep talking about this. Barely we enough to pay yes, rent. We are. No, we're not. No, <clears throat> you are. You need to wake up. Okay? Sorry to interrupt. Stop. Camera? You know what? You must have came to the wrong address. I'm gonna return them on my way to work. Alright. And just a reminder, we have mac and cheese in the fridge for lunch. I don't want her eating any red meat. And her gummy vitamins are on the counter. Or to lead us in today. Okay, that's for Talia, okay. Alright, well, we should get going. Yeah. Uh, and and I thought that she was married to the other guy. Although in the last episode, he was really being self-centered, being misogynistic, and cheating on other women. I didn't know what you were gonna ask. Um, yeah. Let's see what I got. What do you mean about a hundred dollars? Ten thousand. Ten thousand dollars. Ten thousand dollars. That's, that's, that's a lot of money. Um, I'm, I'm sure Jesse would ask us. It's an emergency. All right. Let's, let's talk about it when we get back. Thanks. Yeah. Bye. Uh -huh. Oh, um. And what's that iPad? Uh, and why is that iPad open? Oh, yes. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 
That's the evil nanny. Quick pit stop. Quick pit stop? Okay. Yeah. Talia! Talia, honey! It's Talia, not Talia. There you are, sweetheart. You hungry? Meatloaf? What are you talking about? Oh no! Vitamins. But I like these ones. I like the other ones. Uh uh uh. No, these are much much better for you. Okay. Trust me. All right. People aren't always the way they seem. And ironically, this quote also applies to Darman, too. Considering the way he treats his workers. Oopsies. Oopsies? You are the clumsiest little girl in the world. Club? Jesse, do you know what little brats like to get? Oh no. They get spanked. What do you think you're doing? She heard her! I saw everything. A step away <clears throat> from my daughter. Get out of my yeah, house. She's gonna protect her. You're fine. You can't do that. I yeah, get out. Get out. Such an abusive nanny. It's okay. <clears throat> I need you back home. Yeah. Okay. To get the doorknob fixed or installed. Are you old enough? I just can't believe we let her into our home. Find out she's been hitting Talia. Yeah, so she hits Talia. Yeah, exactly. She basically hits her just to get her to do what she wants. That's terrible. She had access to everything. Honestly, I don't feel right hiring another. Yeah, because this nanny is abusive, and she basically, and she basically hits Talia just to get her to do what she wants. That's terrible. Hopefully. What? Wait. Check. She's probably not there anymore. See? She's been abducted. The nanny went crazy. See, that's what they do. They start to go crazy because now they can no longer control anybody, so what do they do? They kidnap them. I want ten thousand dollars, or you'll never see Talia again. That's ransom. And she says we have until midnight. Eleven thirty-eight East Le Palat Road. I'm gonna call the cops and I'm sending them some tickets. Oh. I wanna send them some tickets. Come on, And where are you gonna send them? Let's go. I can't believe you would do this. You practically raised her. And this is how you treat her? Yeah, you're mistreating her. The same one. Uh, 
You take our daughter for ransom, it's none of our business. It, just like how Darman mistreated his workers and, un, and, un, and underpaid them. No, I would never do that for that. Then what is it? I want to have a baby. That's what the money's for. That's what the money is for? You see. What? Before I started working for you two, mm -hmm. I was married. Okay. And I wanted nothing more than to be a mom. And but then what happened? For years, but I just, I couldn't get pregnant. Oh yeah, but then what happened? So we went to the doctor. And but it was her, that it was her fault. I was the reason I couldn't get pregnant. But the doctor said that But, there but was why was it her fault? Yeah. We're so excited. So we found out how much it cost. $600? Too much. My husband didn't take that very well. 10200 So, since For $10,200. I figured I could at least be close to one. Okay. That's when I decided to be a nanny. So she abducted the kid. Just, just because, just because she, just because of the expenses. She felt less like some kid I was nannying, and more like my own. Yeah, but the way you treated her, you don't deserve to have a kid. So you see, that's why I had to yeah, I feel really sorry for that, but you know, the, you know the way you, the way you treated Talia. Yeah, you didn't deserve having a kid to begin with. Sorry, you had to go through all of that, Jesse. I really am kidnapping our daughter. Exactly. She's more my daughter than she is yours. You are just her nanny. Yeah, you're just a nanny. That's it. I am more than that. And if the and if this is the way you treat kids, such as like spanking them or hitting them just to get them to do what they want, then you never deserve to have kids to begin with. Mommy, Daddy! Freeze! Put your hands in the air! Oh baby! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! Yeah, she definitely deserves to go to jail. I don't understand. How did you Did you know anything about Talia? So Miss Hopping is her absolute favorite toy. And I wanted to make sure she never loses it. So I put a tracker in her bunny. And luckily, when you kidnapped her, she took her bunny along for the ride. While you were trying okay. to us, we were just falling into the cuts we get to eat. How could you do this? She's my family! Not anymore. Not anymore. I've come to realize people aren't always what they seem. So That's I'm ironic sure with how Darman is. is. After we put her in the car, we'll come back and get the statements. I'm going to rate this video 67 out of 100. So thank you so much for watching this and keep liking, commenting, and subscribing.